A Westmoreland County dad's post on Reddit is going viral. It's a lifelife -life chalk drawing with him in front of Norwin High School from a famous Dr. Seuss book, Oh, the Places You'll Go, congratulating the class of 2021. And this is not the only work of art that's drawing attention. Joining me now live over Zoom is the chalking dad himself, Eric Greenewald. Eric, thank you for joining me this Friday night. Hi, Megan. Thanks for having me tonight. I appreciate it. We are just staring at these works of art and wondering how in the world did you get into this? Sure. So uh, that, that piece that you saw that I did at Norman High School, my daughter is a uh, senior graduating uh, uh, next Friday night. And uh, I started drawing in my driveway for her when she was three or four years old and my younger daughter was a year old. They wanted me to draw princesses and Disney characters and the little Einsteins. And uh, one thing led to another. And here 15 years later, uh, doing 3D pieces like that here at you know Norman High School and really all around the world sometimes. Do you have formal art training? I entirely self-taught. I tell people the last, the last art class I took was my freshman year of high school. What? What is your day job? So uh, day job, I work in corporate finance. I do financial planning and analysis for uh, Giant Eagle. Totally makes sense. Like right up the same alley. Yeah. yeah. Right, right, right. It's a, it's a nice, uh, it's a nice counterbalance playing with spreadsheets uh, and numbers all week long. Is uh, getting out on the pavement and, and, and getting dirty and making chalk art. Where do you draw your inspiration from for these pieces? Yeah. Really, depend. It really depends. Uh, sometimes it's thematic. It's current events that might be going on. In this mm -hmm. case, I you know think back to when uh, J.C. who will graduate, who I said graduates next Friday. Uh, when she was little, reading Dr. Seuss books and reading yeah. Oh, the places you'll go, and and here she is, ready to, ready to go and graduate. So really, it's just trying to capture what's uh, you know, my, what's current, what's popular, what I what interests me at uh, any given time. Here in the studio, we really like the one on the driveway where she's sitting on the 3D lifesavers. Mm -hmm. How long does something like that take? That piece took. Um, I, that probably was like four to six hours to you know to, to, to do it in its entirety. But mm -hmm. each piece depends. Each piece is a little bit different. Uh, the 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 Dr. Seuss one was I don't know about ten hours or so. Sometimes I'll do a piece that'll take uh, take a full weekend if I'm at uh, you know it's a large festival. Sometimes uh, a chalk festival can last three days, and I could have eighteen to twenty hours into a piece. So, do you ever wish you were a chalk artist somewhere else other than Pittsburgh with less rain? <laughs> You know, that's the great that's the great thing about chalk art. And I'll say in, in pre COVID times, uh, you know, I really I got to travel all around the country and in twenty nineteen got to go to a chalk festival in England. So uh, it's possible to escape Pittsburgh rain and, and, and go places <laughs> that are a little bit uh, with a little bit more sunshine. There's a lot of a lot of festivals in Florida, uh, California that yeah. you know you can kinda of go to in the off season. But we've had some we've had a beautiful stretch of weather here to do some stuff. It has been nice. Do you have a favorite one that you've done? You know, I've done a lot involving my, you know, a lot involving my kids. Those are always, those are always some of my favorite ones. Uh, you know, that uh, the one you're showing right now, the Purell bottle was uh, right at the start of uh, quarantine last year. And that kind of, uh, I think that first took off on uh, some social media stuff. So um, <gasps> look at that yeah. one, the office. Yeah. Well, thank you so much for, for being so cool. I, I appreciate it for you sharing yeah, you. You, your art with us, Eric. Great. Thanks for having me. I appreciate it. Have a great night and a great weekend. Okay, you too.